What is the highest number you can count to? I mean, what is the biggest number that you can count to in your lifetime? Well, let's separate this question into two separate categories. One category with realistic answers, and one category with more or less unrealistic answers. For the realistic category, we'll have to factor in a bunch of different things like sleeping, eating, and all the things that are required to survive. For the unrealistic category, we won't factor in too much. Let's say you live an average lifespan of about 80 years or so. Let's say you were born counting up from zero and didn't stop counting until you died. How high would you get? Well, I mean, we could do some simple math to kind of sort of figure that out. So there are about 29,200 days in 80 years. And that's about 700,800 hours, which is about 42,048,000 minutes, which is about 2,522,880,000 seconds. So a lot of people would say that you would be able to count to about 2.5 billion. I mean, that's what makes logical sense if you live 2.5 billion seconds, but that's not entirely right. Even with this unrealistic category, we still have to factor in the fact that it takes more than a second to say each of these numbers. When you get up to like the quintillions or the millions, it takes a bit longer than one second to say each number, right? So with some kind of sort of complicated math, we can figure out that on average, out of your 2.5 billion seconds of existence, it would take about 3.88 seconds to count up each number. That's, that's counting all the numbers that take under a second to say, like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and all the numbers that take well over a second to say, like 333,333,333. So, if it takes on average 3.88 seconds per number, then you would get up to about 650,226,804 before you died. That's if you were counting since you were born. 650 million. Is that really it? I honestly thought it would be higher. I mean, you hear these numbers thrown out like billion, trillion, quadrillion, but 650 million doesn't seem very big compared to those. And I mean, there's people on the planet, many people on the planet that have well over $650 million. Okay, okay, okay. So that was the unrealistic number you could count to. For the realistic number, you'd have to factor in many other things. You can't count for 24 hours a day, every day, for about 80 years. You still need to eat, sleep, and take care of yourself, you know, in order to survive. So, let's say that you're only counting on average of 12 hours every day. That's an incredibly high estimate, by the way. But, you can't just start counting from the second you're born. So, let's say you start counting from the moment you learn what numbers are. Let's say you start counting as soon as you learn how to actually count. That usually happens around first grade. Maybe earlier in some places, but normally it happens around first grade. So you'd be about six or seven years old. So, great. That only gives you 12 hours a day, every day, for about 74 years. And that's if you're like really, really, really dedicated and you're literally counting until you die. So, doing some math, you would end up counting for a total of about 1.16 billion seconds. And since that number's lower, the average time per number that it takes to count is actually slightly lower at 3.24 seconds per number. So you would end up counting to about 360,133,333 before you die. Man, 360 million? And that's the realistic one? It's kind of sucky. I mean, I made a video on how long it would take to count to one decillion. 360 million is just so small and I mean that means that there's thousands of people out there that if they really wanted to they couldn't even count their money in their lifetime like you can't you can't count up to a billion that's just not something you're able to do that's actually kind of sad whatever 
It was just a dumb thought. <laughs> so there you go. That's that. Alright. Yep. Bye.